Good morning, everyone, and happy Wednesday. Hopefully you are having a good start to your week once again. Today we are checking out Rich Presence, which adds a Discord presence for your 5M server. A few people have asked for this, so I wanted to cover it. This one um, adds the ability to have your FPS, your username, and your ID in it, which is kind of cool. And it also allows you to have a button for your Discord server and your connecting to your overall 5M server. Pretty cool. I think it's a cool idea. All you have to do is go to the GitHub page linked in the description below and go ahead and download with the big green button and press download zip. This is going to be very easy to install, kind of just like any of our other resources. You're going to open this up with winzip, 7zip, winrar. And then you're going to, when you're in here, you're going to see there's an underscore underscore resource.lula. You should probably update this to an FX manifest file author if you're watching this and you're going to have a client.lula. All right, so once we are inside of our server here, you can see we have server data and server. We're going to go into our server data resources folder and we're just going to go ahead and create a new folder. And I'm just going to call this Discord just to have right here. And then I'm going to drag these two files in here. And then inside of our client.lula is actually where we're going to modify anything we want for this script. So you can see you have all of the local variables and stuff in here. And what I'm going to do is down here at the bottom, this is where you actually modify it. So I'm going to go ahead and modify this to R. So discord.gg slash bghd development. And I'm going to do the same thing. And I'm going to go ahead and copy that um, down to this little uh, button down here. So you can actually click the button. And then this is where your uh, connect is. So you're going to do 5M connect. And then whatever your IP and port is for me, I'm going to keep it local host. Because obviously this is a local host server. But you change this to whatever it is. Um, and then you can switch around this. This is where your FPS count is. This is where your nick is for your in-game username. And this is where your ID is. And you can see there is the ID there. So I'm going to go in and save this. And then I'm going to go to my server data, server.cfg file, edit it with Notepad++, and add ensure Discord, the folder name that we just created. Now when we go ahead and start up our server, as long as we see started resource a Discord right there in here, we know we are good to go. So why don't we hop in game and look what it seems on Discord. All right, so we are in game and now my Discord status is showing it correctly. Sadly, my Discord client on my desktop doesn't seem to be going off my custom status, but my phone is showing it. So if I can, I will go ahead and add a little overview picture of what it looks like um, for the user. Obviously, the buttons aren't on mobile, but the buttons are on supposed to be on the desktop. So that is this resource. Sorry about the coughing. I am a little bit sick at the moment. Luckily, it's not COVID. I've had that over Christmas. It was not fun. But um, obviously, if you have any uh, questions about the resource or have any issues, please leave them on the resource page for the author to fix. And um, we'll go from there. So thanks so much for watching today's video. My name is Noodles, and I will see you in the next video in just a day or so from now. Thanks so much for watching, everyone. My car looks like it's going to explode. Yeah. Here's to the good days. Here's to the sorrows. This is a mistake. I know about tomorrow I don't want to fight no more Cause I don't feel the need no more, no Just want to make it stop